In this video, we will look at how to determine whether a number is inside a range or outside a range of values. When determining whether a number is inside a range, we use the AND operator. Now look at the following example. To check whether a number is inside the range of 30 to 60, and that's now 30 and 60 included also, let us first examine the values to understand the logic behind it. Inside the range means between 30 and 60. So it would be 30, 31, 32, up until 58, 59, 60. So you will agree that it is all values greater than 30, but also less than 60. So how will we then use an if statement to check for this? Now evaluate the following statement. So the question here is, if the value is greater than or equal to 30, and at the same time the value is also less than or equal to 60. Both sides of the AND operator must be true. So let us take the value of 40 as an example. Is 40 greater than or equal to 30? Yes it is. It's greater than 30. Is 40 at the same time also less than or equal to 60? Yes. So the AND operator works for us in this case. Let us now take the value of 20. Now, 20 is in fact outside of the range, and we want our if statement to actually evaluate to false. So, is 20 greater than or equal to 30? No. Is 20 less than or equal to 60? Yes. But because both sides must be true for the AND operator, this expression would result in a false value. Exactly what we want. Now, what about the OR operator? Can we use the OR operator as well, or can we just use the AND? So let's evaluate the OR operator quickly. Remember that for the OR operator, only one side of the operator must be true for the whole expression to be true. So here we ask, is X greater than or equal to 30? Or is X less than or equal to 60? So a value of 100 would make the left side true, and the value of 10 would make the right side true. Can you see that we cannot use the OR to check for values inside a range? Now how do we check for values outside a specific range? Let us take 30 and 60 again. Outside the range of 30 to 60 would mean less than 30 or greater than 60. Now let us evaluate using the AND operator again. This would read, if x are less than 30 and at the same time greater than 60. So do you think this is possible for a value to be both less than 30 and greater than 60 at the very same time? Remember both sides of the AND must be true for the whole expression to be true. So let us take the value of 20. 20 is outside the range of 30 to 60. Can 20 be less than 30? Yes. Can 20 also be more than 60 at the same time? Definitely not. So it's clear that we cannot use the AND operator now again to check for values outside of a range. We can use it to check values for inside a specific range. So we must use the OR operator. Now evaluate the following statement. The question in this case is, is x less than 30 or is x greater than 60? Only one of the two needs to be true for the OR operator to evaluate to true. So let us take the value of 20 again. 20 is less than 30, so the left side would be true. Is 20 greater than 60? No, so the right side would be false. This expression would then return true. Let's take the value of 40, which would be inside the range and not outside of the range. Is 40 less than 30? Definitely no. Is 40 greater than 60? Also no. Both sides evaluate to false, which would make the whole expression false. That's it for this video. See you in the next one.